Have you ever wondered how everything around us, the universe, came into being? Well, that's where the Big Bang Theory steps in. A theory that stands as the most comprehensive explanation for the inception of our universe. Let's rewind a bit. All the way back to about 13.8 billion years ago. Picture everything that exists. All matter, all energy, compressed into an infinitesimally small, infinitely hot, infinitely dense point, a singularity. Now from this singularity, an explosion of unimaginable scale occurs, the Big Bang. In less than a second, the universe inflated from this singularity into an unimaginably large expanse. And it didn't just stop there. Picture a balloon inflating, that's how our universe has been expanding ever since. From a state of extreme heat and density, it started to cool and expand, leading to the formation of subatomic particles and later simple atoms. But what about the stuff we're made of, the heavier elements like carbon, nitrogen and oxygen? Well, they weren't created in the Big Bang. They were cooked up later in the hearts of stars over billions of years and released into the cosmos upon the death of these stars. So, in essence, we are all made of star stuff, born from the cataclysmic events that shape the universe. Pretty mind-blowing, isn't it? But the Big Bang Theory isn't just about the birth of the universe. It also provides an explanation for a host of other phenomena. From the large-scale structure of the cosmos, to the ripple of cosmic microwave background radiation, the afterglow of that initial explosion, which we can still detect today. And here's another fascinating fact, the universe is still expanding. Stars and galaxies are moving away from each other. We're part of a universe that's not only vast and wondrous, but also dynamic and ever-changing. So the Big Bang Theory gives us a glimpse into the birth of our universe, but what about its structure? As the universe expanded and cooled, structures started to form. But how exactly? To answer this, we need to journey back to a time when the universe was just a cosmic soup of particles. As gravity did its work, these particles began to clump together, forming the first galaxies. Picture these galaxies as vast cosmic islands composed of stars, gas, dust, and an elusive substance known as dark matter. These elements, bound by the unyielding grip of gravity, whirl and dance together in an intricate cosmic ballet. Now, imagine a massive cloud of gas and dust in these galaxies. This is a nebula, the birthplace of stars. Nebulae are like cosmic nurseries, brimming with potential. They can be light years across and their vast expanses provide the perfect stage for the creation of new stars. But how does a star form within a nebula? It all begins with gravity. The nebula's own gravity pulls its gas and dust inward, creating a dense core. This core or protostar continues to gather mass from the surrounding nebula. As it grows, the pressure and temperature in its heart escalate until it reaches a critical point. At this juncture, nuclear fusion starts and a star is born. Now let's consider the galaxies again. They're not just random conglomerates of stars and nebulae. They have structure and form and they evolve over time. Some are spiral-shaped, like our own Milky Way, with arms of stars and gas spiraling out from a central bulge. Others are elliptical, composed mainly of older stars with little gas or dust. Still, others are irregular, with no distinct shape, often the result of gravitational interactions or collisions with other galaxies. These celestial structures are as fascinating as they are complex. Galaxies and nebulae together form the backbone of the universe. Their intricate dance of creation and evolution shapes the cosmos as we know it. Yet, something even more mysterious lurks within them. In the vast expanse of galaxies, lurk entities so strange that they defy our understanding of physics, black holes. Imagine a region in space where gravity is so intense that nothing, absolutely nothing, not even light, can escape its grasp. That's what a black hole is. Formed from the remnants of massive stars, they are the ultimate endpoints of matter. When these giant stars exhaust their nuclear fuel, they collapse under their own gravity, creating a singularity, an infinitely small and dense point where the very fabric of space and time is twisted beyond recognition. Now what makes black holes so entrancing is their event horizon. Picture a boundary, a point of no return. Once anything crosses this event horizon, it is forever lost to the black hole's insatiable appetite. This region is so named because once you venture beyond it, no event, no information can ever reach the outside universe. It's like the ultimate cosmic secret keeper, but black holes aren't just cosmic vacuum cleaners, they are also key players in the grand cosmic ballet. Their immense gravitational pull can influence the orbits of nearby stars, and even shape the very structure of galaxies, 
Moreover, at the heart of most galaxies, including our own Milky Way, lurks a supermassive black hole, millions to billions times the mass of our Sun, silently shaping the destiny of its galactic home. Yet despite their fearsome reputation, black holes are not invincible. They can slowly lose energy through a process called Hawking radiation, named after the legendary physicist Stephen Hawking. Over time this can cause a black hole to shrink and eventually evaporate entirely, a process that would take longer than the current age of the universe for a stellar black hole. So, black holes, these enigmatic beasts of the cosmos with their mind-bending physics and paradoxes, continue to be a hotbed for scientific investigation. They challenge our understanding, test our theories, and remind us of the vast mysteries that the universe holds. Black holes, a cosmic enigma, continue to baffle and intrigue us. But our journey doesn't end here. In this vast universe are we alone, or is there life beyond Earth? The notion of alien life has always sparked our curiosity. We've been gazing at the stars for millennia, wondering if among the billions of galaxies, trillions of stars and countless planets ours is the only one teeming with life. Life as we understand it requires certain conditions. A source of energy, like our sun, is crucial. Water, often termed the elixir of life, is another vital component. And then there's the need for suitable temperatures and chemically complex environments to enable the formation and evolution of life, but where might these conditions exist beyond Earth? Let's start within our solar system. Mars, our planetary neighbor, has long been a place of interest. It exhibits evidence of past liquid water, and its polar ice caps suggest the presence of water even today. The planet's thin atmosphere and temperature fluctuations pose challenges, but the potential for microbial life or evidence of past life still exists. Then we have the moons of Jupiter and Saturn. Europa, one of Jupiter's largest moons is believed to harbor an ocean beneath its icy surface, heated by the moon's internal tidal forces. Saturn's moon, Enceladus, also possesses an underground ocean, and has been observed spewing geysers of water vapor into space, indicating the presence of hydrothermal activity, a potential source of chemical energy for life. Beyond our solar system the hunt for exoplanets in the habitable zone around other stars, also known as Goldilocks Zone, has resulted in exciting discoveries. These planets are at just the right distance from their stars for liquid water to exist on their surfaces, increasing the chances of life. However, it's important to remember that these are conditions for life as we know it. The universe is vast and diverse and life, if it exists elsewhere, might not conform to our Earth-centric expectations. The search for extraterrestrial life continues to be one of the most exciting quests in science. Now let's shift our gaze from potential alien life to our own species' future in space. As we venture into the cosmos, we are not only exploring the vast expanse of space, but we're also discovering more about ourselves, about what it means to be an intelligent species capable of space travel. The very idea of leaving our home planet and venturing into the cosmic playground was once the stuff of science fiction, but today, it's a reality thanks to the remarkable advancements in technology. Our journey into space began with small, tentative steps. It started with the launch of the first artificial satellite, Sputnik, by the Soviet Union in 1957. This was followed by the historic Apollo moon landing in 1969, where for the first time, humans set foot on an extraterrestrial body. Since then, we've sent spacecraft to every corner of our solar system, from the scorching surface of Venus to the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn. We've landed rovers on Mars, flown past the dwarf planet Pluto, and even sent spacecraft out of the solar system into the vast interstellar space. But we're not stopping there. Plans for the future of space travel are ambitious. The next big goal is to send humans to Mars, a task that NASA, SpaceX, and other organizations around the world are fervently working towards. There are also plans for establishing a permanent human presence on the moon and perhaps even further afield in the future. As we push the boundaries of what's possible, we're not just exploring space, we're also exploring what it means to be an intelligent species. What does it mean to live and thrive not just on Earth but in space? How will space travel change us physically, culturally, and psychologically? These are questions we're only beginning to grapple with, but one thing is clear. As we continue to explore we grow closer to becoming not just inhabitants of Earth but citizens of the universe. Our journey from the Big Bang to the possibilities of future space travel has been nothing short of amazing. We have traversed the cosmos, from the very beginning of our universe, into the mysteries of our present, and peered into the wonders of the future. We began with the Big Bang, the grand cosmic explosion that marked the genesis of the universe. 
an event so powerful it set the stage for the formation of all matter, energy, space and time. From this fiery inception, the universe expanded and cooled, leading to the formation of the first atoms, then stars, and eventually galaxies. Our voyage then took us to the stunning formations of galaxies and nebulae. These celestial structures with their intricate patterns and breathtaking colors, are the cosmic nurseries where stars are born. Galaxies, vast collections of stars, gas, dust and dark matter, each with its unique shape and size, form the backbone of the universe. We delved into the enigmatic black holes, the cosmic titans that can warp space and time. These astronomical phenomena, born from the death of massive stars, are regions where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their pull. Their study continues to challenge and reshape our understanding of the universe. We pondered the possibility of alien life, exploring the conditions necessary for life to thrive. The discovery of exoplanets in the habitable zone, the tantalizing clues of water on Mars, and the complex chemistry of celestial bodies, all point towards the potential existence of extraterrestrial beings. Lastly, we ventured into the realm of human space travel. The dreams of setting foot on distant planets, the technological advancements needed, and the sheer determination of the human spirit, all contribute to making the notion of interstellar travel a reality to look forward to. The universe is vast and full of mysteries and as we continue to unravel these mysteries we learn more about our place in it. We're glad you joined us on this cosmic journey. From the mind-bending inception of the universe to the tantalizing possibilities of space travel and alien life, it has been a pleasure sharing this voyage with you. Our universe is a cosmic labyrinth, rich with wonders and mysteries waiting to be unraveled. And we're thrilled to explore more of these with you. If you found this journey enlightening and desire to keep exploring the cosmos with us, do subscribe and turn on notifications. This way, you'll stay well informed and won't miss any of our future voyages into the depths of the cosmos. Remember, every new discovery takes us one step closer to understanding our place in the universe. Join us as we continue to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos one video at a time. Until our next journey, keep looking up, keep exploring and thank you for your time. Have a very pleasant day ahead.